around the table. Turn 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 around the table. Did I mention dinner on the table? I'll be right in with the lasagna, guys. Be careful, it's very hot. I don't care if it's hot, just as long as it's here. Yuck! Yuck is putting it mildly. <clears throat> Instead of this, could we, like, uh, have some food, please? I'm sorry you don't like it. It's Joe's frozen microwave lasagna. I didn't have time to make fresh. Can you live with it? <laughs> all right, all right. Get in the car. We'll go to Vito's. Mm. Vito, you're the master. And I tell you, this is a lot better than Joe's frozen microwave lasagna. So is appendicitis. Oh, I thank you. But the true master was a man who taught me how to cook. The great Giuseppe Squisito. He made the best lasagna in the world. He was your teacher? He was my teacher, my mentor, my hero. The greatest Italian chef who ever molded a meatball. We were so fortunate, those of us who got to train under him. You call yourself a chef. I should make you all turn in your soil to aprons. Tell me, what are the two most important ingredients in anything you cook? Your heart and your soul. I can hear you. Your heart and your soul. Until you learn that, you will never be worthy of the honor of being called a chef. If only I could hear him call me that. Well, invite him. I'm sure he... Oh, no, 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 no. He retired. Uh, disappeared long before I opened the Vito's here. No one knows where he is. Or even if he is still among us. Hmm. Quiet, Ori. Many a night, I dream of him seeing it, tasting my marinara and saying, Vito, you are a chef. Ah, but it will never happen. Hey, let me get you some of Vito's world-famous thick crust pizza, eh? Huh? Vito's a good guy. I hope someday he sees that chef Squisito again. <laughs> Best lasagna in the world. The 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 best lasagna in the world. I've got to have it. I've got to have it. I've got to have the best lasagna in the world. Squeak. Wake up! Wake up, Squeak! Ow! <laughs> Garfield, you woke me up, right? In the middle of a cheese dream. Squeak, I need your help. Oh, it was about cheddar. That's my favorite. Squeak, I need you to alert the mouse network. I have to find a chef named Giuseppe Squisito. Uh, can't it wait till morning? Sure. <laughs> All right, it's morning. Find him. He's the man who makes the best lasagna in the world. Garfield, lunch is on the table. How do you expect me to eat this when the best lasagna in the world is out there, just somewhere waiting to be eaten? <laughs> hey, I have to keep my strength up. Garfield, Garfield, my friend Irv here found him. Tell him, Irv. You're uh, looking for Chef Giuseppe Squisito? Desperately. Well, I moved. I now live in a cheese factory. Lucky guy. And Chef Squisito, he comes in all the time to buy mozzarella, ricotta, and parmesan. <gasps> the three basic ingredients in the best lasagna in the world. <laughs> Take me to him. Take me to him right now. Can we walk faster? He lives in a shack out this way. Why are we going all the way out here, Garfield? 
because I must have the best lasagna in the world. That's it. He lives there. Thanks. Okay, you guys can go home. I'm gonna go eat the best lasagna in the world. <laughs> Kitty cat, what do you want? Ah, 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 ah. You want the lasagna? Meow. The best lasagna in the world? <laughs> no. So you think Garfield will get lasagna? Garfield always gets lasagna. Ugh. Yeah, I know I look stupid, but there's nothing I won't do for the best lasagna in the world. Uh -huh. Down here, Tiny. A little bambino left on my doorstep. Are you hungry, a little baby? Yeah, hungry. Then I get you the most the delicious food any baby would want to eat. <laughs> Here we come. The best. <laughs> Baby food made out of turnips and oatmeal. <laughs> Do not cry, little bambino. Squisito will find you something you will like. <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't laugh. You used to sound just like this. <laughs> Here, a little one. You will like this. Hmm, this is not working out. I need to find some paper. What am I going to do? I cannot keep a baby around here, even a homely, fuzzy one. How can I find its a mother? <laughs> a note? I did not notice a note there before. If you find this baby, please feed it the best lasagna in the world, his mother. No, I do not think a lasagna is a healthy food for little babies. Then, return him to 150 West Central Avenue. Come, my little bambino. I take you back to your mother. Are you sure you don't want to grab a quick bite before we do this? This is 150 West Central Avenue. Vito's Pizzeria? You live here, a little baby? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Chef Esquisito! Oh, oh, Chef Esquisito, it is you! Do you not remember me? Vito Capelletti, I was one of your students. Vito Capelletti, one of my worst students. You were the one who tried putting spaghetti on a barbecue. <sighs> Yes, but uh, I learned. I learned from you. And, and now I have my own restaurant. Uh, please, uh, taste my tagliatelle. Uh, sample my spumoni. I would not soil my taste buds with your cooking. But I am a good cook now. For... You could not possibly be a... Um... Hey, that's not a bad meatball. You... You like it? In fact, it is a very good meatball. Tell me, how is your cannelloni? My cannelloni? It is, uh, it's, a. Uh... It is, uh, under the way. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. I have here a nice cannelloni for you. Ah, I want you to try my fettuccine Alfredo. Oh, and you must try my chicken marsala and my garlic bread. Mm. Vito, you truly are a chef. Oh, oh, thank you. 
Oh, grazie, maestro. Uh, thank you. And you, pussy gato. I am in your debt for making this happen. How can I show my appreciation? <laughs> Garfield, I don't know how you did it. You actually got Chef Squizito to come here and prepare his world-famous lasagna for us. I have not cooked in many years, not since I retired. I sold my recipe to a company that markets it as... Ah, it is ready. Woohoo! Ah! Wow! Here you are! Joe's a frozen a microwave lasagna! Uh, uh, Chef Squizito, I don't know how to tell you this, but we tried Joe's frozen microwave lasagna and it was terrible. <laughs> terrible? But it is so tasty and so easy to make. You just peel off the plastic film and microwave it. Plastic film? Uh. Hey, if you take the plastic film off before you cook it, mm, this is the best lasagna in the world. Uh. Mm. 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 <laughs> 